Brittany Griner, a grand total of 20 people showed up to her homecoming celebration in Waco, Texas. Her hometown of Waco, where she went to school and where she made her name, Baylor University. 20 people showed up. A dove. 20. I'm surprised people. there was that many. 20 people showed That's up. That's impressive. Let's be and, honest. And 15 of them helped organize the event. Right. I think eight, about 18 of them. <laughs> yo, think about this, yo. All that shit, all that talk. We gave up the merchant of death, the right. merchant of death for somebody who okay. only got 20 people. Yo, I bet he got more than 20 too. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's got he they're gonna throw a fucking parade for him, man. You kidding? <laughs> hey, Hack, you remember when uh when this first came out, we went and checked the tw the uh Instagrams and shit of her fellow players. And none of them were posting shit about right. it. Right, exactly. <laughs> nobody gives nobody the, the love is it's all it's all online. All yeah. this shit is internet shit. These people yeah. don't really care in real life. It's all just cloud chasing. It's yeah, like. They don't give a shit about Britney Grinder, man. This Twenty is, people. That's, that's sad, man. I mean that that is fucking sad, man. I mean just. Do you Food do you know? ways, man? He said, "Ah, you are a Kwanzaa." <laughs> 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 Yo, when does Kwanzaa start, see? Was already started, man. Oh, the Ak, you are Kwanzaa, <laughs> give me all those bladders. Merry Christmas, Chief to the man. Um, yeah, people man. Really care that she went just and were there locked up. I mean, people got real world problems. Nobody cared a thing about her. Nobody yeah, but know who she was. Listen though, man, like all this clamor. Okay, I would get that. A I would get that AP if it was in fucking Alaska. You know what I'm saying? Or some shit like that. <laughs> but it was in fucking, you know what I'm saying? So this is her fucking hometown. No, don't give me that shit. This is her fucking hometown, man. No, that's different. It should be, should be, that shit should be teeming with people. It should be overflowing. It should be fucking CNN. CNN and shit didn't even come with it. Like, damn, we ain't even got enough crisis actors. Like, think about it. They would have to think about how many crisis actors, because you know they sprinkle crisis actors in all these situations. They would have to like use like <laughs> they would have to break the piggy bank, go into the emergency funds, and, and I'll, there's there's probably more reporters there than anybody at all. Yo, I, I it's just embarrassing. And here's the thing, she don't there because she's a woman and because she's just WNBA, it's almost like they they can't be embarrassed anymore. They're so <laughs> embarrassed that it's like there's nothing it, it can't get any worse. This is this is embarrassing to the one thousand power. And the worst ESPN part about it, had a fit. She was not a political prisoner. She was caught with the contraband on her. She knew she was breaking the law. She, I mean, she, but that's irrelevant, AP. Yeah, that's irrelevant, though, AP. It's she assists that, right? And she's a member of the Rainbow Crew too. Exactly. Oh yeah. Yeah. She, she, she's a sister. She got. She's checking off boxes, man. <laughs> um. Yeah, it, but this is this is just this is him. This is so embarrassing. It's cringy. Yeah. It's cringing, bro. 20 people? <laughs> Yo, but is Waco uh, like a providence of the state? Is there a lot of, you know? Yes, Waco is it, any, anywhere. It's like it's like outside of Houston. Mm. It's a big guy. I mean, Waco, what's, let me see. Let me see the population of Waco, man. Um, Waco is Be not. Because we know the gliders, we know they're racist, so they're not going to go, right? But... Well, those were the ones. Hold on. Those are the ones that got her home, though. Oh, yeah, but yeah, that don't logic don't matter when it comes right. To it don't matter, you know that. Yeah, it goes about 150,000, and 20 of them showed up. <laughs> I mean, come on, and that ain't like they got a fucking you know what I'm saying. It ain't a lot, a lot to do in Waco, it ain't like they got <laughs> fucking Broadway plays going on down there. And they 20 percent, yeah, so mm. it's a 
listen, man, everybody who ever helped Brittany in life, from her college basketball coach to her high school to the <laughs> scouts to the people in the WNBA, everyone who's ever helped her was white. Mm. And I bet you 19 of the people there were white. <laughs> Yo, I but the girl, the only female that could dunk deserves better than this. I know she got more dunks than people were there. <laughs> shit. That shit is crazy, man. I, I would have gone if I if I heard I would you know I would have showed love, you know. Welcome home, touch down. Yeah, man. I would have definitely showed love. If listen, if, if that shit was in my little town. I would have definitely swung by, man. I'd be like, yo, salute, man. I mean, just for the fact that it ain't shit to do. <laughs> and you know what I'm saying? that's that a free been... meal, man. <laughs> Bullshit. You know that shit was catered. <laughs> yeah, this shit is incredible. Like 20 people? Yo, uh, whoever was the PR guy for that, fired. Right. I mean, God. Damn, man. I go about a fucking terrible job. Get the word out, bro. What you, yeah, one job. One job. 20, like, yo, if it was 200, I want you to know that. If it was 200, that would have been embarrassing. <laughs> I promise. No, I'm not even joking. It, it, Cause it's supposed to be thousands. It's supposed to be like people outside in Santa room only inside. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, is there a video of this? That was the only picture I showed you. Damn. Well, uh, it just shows you what an embarrassment this country has become. Because you look at that guy that they exchanged her for. I mean, this is a major arms dealer. He's highly intelligent. I mean, he has connections. And mm -hmm. we traded him for her. Right. Well, well AP, wait, wait, hold, hold. Did you say that guy? That guy has a name, all right? Merchant of Death. All right. right. <laughs> yeah, What's man. the respect on his name? Right, right. And it wasn't given to him by social media either. That name stands for Right. They, 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 I heard that name was given to him by, by the motherfuckers he was, yeah. like, serving. Yeah, right. he, nah, he he didn't get that name from on, online. He got that name from the trenches. Right, exactly. He got that name about the trenches, man. He, that's what they called him on the streets, my G. Right, what they say, Aaron not giving? <laughs> yeah, especially in, in, in Africa. Like, he, that's what right. he was... Like the, he was he he was in the trenches of all trenches in the Congo shit. Yeah, he wasn't he wasn't hey. no yeah. You know, they got the merchant of death back, and we got the misses that dunk. <laughs> <laughs> I get a pretty fair trade. Yo, I, I, I wish they would have interviewed <laughs> these twenty people. Like, what are you doing here? Like, are you lost? Yeah, you know man. You man. Dude, they should have went to the local homeless shelter and said, come on down, free meal. Right, right. Whatever. Okay. They, they should have they should have did a high school field trip, Chief. I mean, don't get sit there. And if, right. you know, if you don't, you get an F, motherfucker. You fail. Right. Like, I mean, they could have done anything. They could have went to the homeless shelter and just told everybody, hey, everybody, it's free meals down here, man, if you should come down. But they could have did anything to make the numbers bigger. Like, I, I bet when they when when as the time started rolling by, because you know at first it's probably like okay people must all right all right people just must be in the traffic or but somebody checked traffic see what's happening yeah, yeah. or somebody checked the weather like they're probably like trying to make, maybe something's going on but as the hours <laughs> rolled on, yo, hey, you, I, know, you know I, I you know, bet like, ten of them were wearing masks. Hey, oh, Chief. not in Texas though. Chief, you know that kid that has like a birthday party invites the whole class, nobody shows up. That's yeah, that's so sad, man. That's why I would. That's why you would always say have it at school so everybody has to come. Like just pop up at your kid's class with the fucking goodies <laughs> and shit. That's like what they that. should do when I was in school. They would, the parents would just pop up in class with fucking huggies and shit. Right, cake. pizza. <laughs> yeah, we would just have it right there because you can't you can't fucking miss with that one. Yeah, if I had my daughter had a fucking birthday party and nobody showed up, I'd be so sad, man. But I always heard yeah, that's a good idea you just said. But I always heard you don't invite the whole class. You invite mm -hmm. like the his, you know two three friends. Yeah, yeah. This is this is just this is sparse, man. Like this is this is like this is like I did. Did she come out? Because if, if if think about it, if I'm her and 
And like, you know what I'm saying? You think it's gonna be this big thing. You like, you 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 preparing in the mirror the night before your speech and shit. Yo, I want to thank everybody. Like you right now, so you don't forget nobody and shit. The plot, the way it's like yeah. the whole plot. And then the next day you see this, I wouldn't even come up there. I would I would have a guy say, hey, um, Brittany wants to thank all you guys for showing up. But right now, she's just so overwhelmed Man. by you know, being home, and she, you know, she's you know, carpet munching and shit. So it's like, but but I, where, where, where are all these fucking goofy ass athletes and celebrities that were talking all this shit? Where the where the where they at? They they, they could they could they at least tweet about it, you know? And yeah, it? make some attention for it, man. This, this is this is this is so embarrassing. This is it's it's like it's it, it, I feel like. I feel bad for her, and, I, and I, I'm not a big fan. I really feel bad for her. Where are all her LGBT XYZ people? That, not that's there. Right. They're not there. They didn't. I don't even think they even posted anything on their pages. Right. I, I, I guess I, celebrating I, domestic abusers isn't a popular thing. Mm -hmm. I actually, probably made more friends, and you know, in the gulag, they probably would have showed up if they given like release to go. You know. You know how they let him go to a funeral? <laughs> Maybe she, she, had, she, she probably had more friends in the gulag with the Russian bitches. Yeah, and man. It seems like, anyway. Can't get this worse is, than this. This is embarrassing. Secondhand embarrassment is insane on this one. But I'm not going to lie to you, Chief. I don't feel bad for him. I feel bad yeah. for the Marine. And I don't, I'm, I'm not going to pretend like I even remember his name right now. Paul? Paul Whelan, Mark Fogel. I feel bad for them. Got a couple of them. Wow. It's just sad, man. I mean, if, if I was her, to be honest, I'd be disappointed, but I wouldn't give a fuck. I'm home. You know, I I was in Russia about a week ago, a week ago. Oh, and you know she's already got a book deal with, waiting for her when she get when she got back. Which no one's gonna buy. No yeah, I wouldn't. It. I think if I was a if I was a um, publishing company and I saw this, I'd be like, "Oh, what the fuck?" I would be, I would be, you know, doing a double take. Like, wait a second, man. Yeah, I'd be canceling yeah. that that advance. Yeah, job. <laughs> her advance, her advances should be like fifty bucks, man. <laughs> and yeah, that's just, too much, even. Uh, man, I'd give her two pencils and a fucking notebook. Yeah, man, this is. <laughs> This is crazy. Like, this is this is this is like, this is so bad. I feel so bad for this woman. Man. I Do you think any of the pro wax are gonna have on the show? Like that? Um, what's the short fat guy? Um, Roland. Roland Martin or the other one with the glasses that's always mad at everybody. Maybe oh, Tasha K yeah. might have on. Who knows? The one that's always crying. Yeah, that one. You talking about um Rachel Maddow? No, the dude from TYT. No, the, the, black, the black dude. The oh, Richard Richie. Richard Richie. Yeah. Richie. The, yeah. the professor? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, him, professor. This is this is insane. 20 people showed up. Like, I mean, like, that talk, you know, I, I believe people speak with actions. And when someone tells you how they feel, with their mouth, it hurts, but the actions, it does, it might not hurt as bad with the actions <laughs> as it does with the words, but it it it, it feels it, the effect is bigger. It speaks volumes. Yeah, exactly. Yo, and, but she, yeah, um, it, somebody could have told her, look, Whitney, man, Brittany, nobody gives a fuck about you. But she could have been like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, fuck you. I know people love me, man. People online, man. I, I look at my Twitter. Blah, blah, blah. I'm going, I was trending the topics, man. Everybody was sitting in fucking, you know, concerned for me. Everybody was tweeting about me. Everybody was wishing me well blah, 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 all these months. Fuck you. you. What do you mean nobody gives a fuck about me? You're lying. Mm -hmm. But this right here, <laughs> it's Trump's like anything somebody could say, like, I oh. just, it's, oh, but I, you know how they're going to spin it. 
they're gonna be like, oh, she's back home. She's a woman who suffered so much and been through hell. She's a political prisoner, mm-hmm. and none of her white supporters came out to support her. Mm. Yep. What is wrong no. with them? No, no, oh, yeah, allies... this, is, this is the triple hit. You got misogyny, racism, and anti-LGBT. All in one. Oh, they're going to guys... milk it. I'm telling you, the next couple yeah. of weeks, they'll be like, oh, the, her, all of her, they talked a big game, but when she comes home, nobody was there to reach her. Mm. How did you feel, Brittany, being shunned by the media, by the mm. white media? By your LGBT, is it that only yeah. black LGBT, trans, queer, XYZs don't count? Only whites? Mm, What's going yeah, on? Yeah. You know they're going to spin it. I don't even think they're going to say anything about this. I think the liberal media is going to hide this. I think it's done. I think it's a done story. You know, to the next one, you know? ESPN's already already on it. Who was mad about it? You said somebody was mad? Oh, yeah. Hold who? on. Let me, I'll find it. I'll find the who, story. Who, who, who was it? Stephen A? <laughs> Oh, prop. No, they're see all the all the main guys are on vacation this week, mm. and most of the media. But I, in this day and age, the you know, like like AP said, she beat me to it. I was about to say, but in this day and age, it shows you that we still have a lot of a, a lot a long way to go. Nothing has changed since eighteen sixty five, man. 